We're back once more, mortals. Let us see what these fairies can give me for a waffle. Waffle! Wow, thanks. What would you do for a waffle? Kill does, everyone. Does, well, I mean, you killed a chick. You evil bastard. It yes. had it coming. <laughs> Very delicious. I don't feel very feel tired anymore. I apparently do feel like I need to cough my lungs out. <laughs> That's what you get for insulting me, Detective Jax. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, it was your fault. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure. Powers stretch farther than you could imagine. Uh huh. That's great. Thanks very much. As for something in return, well, it feels strange calling it that, but I'm now all full, so you can eat the rest. Saved half the waffle. I'd like to eat a waffle, too. Cleared a waffle, please. And you're dead. You can't eat anything. Well, you can see if you can give it to her. Uh, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna just skip past what they say because I think they're all saying the same thing. But uh, yeah. Okay, nothing new. Can you I go out and talk sure. to what's his face? Ah, uh, uh, no, no, she's saying says, the same thing again. She's like, man, do you know how much I hate burned? He sucks. Poor burned. What's that? God, this room seems like it's deteriorating more. Yeah, this room's deteriorating <sighs> really fast. Ah, uh, burned. What is it? I just noticed. Um, with Burns' text box, there's a little dog in it. With Angie's, there's a little cat. Oh, yeah, yeah. The text boxes actually change what they have in them. It's another cute detail. Um, yeah. like I was saying earlier, this game actually has a lot of cute potential. It's still pretty cute, but it has a lot of cute potential, but, you know, it decides to use it on things that I love. Like, horror. Uh, it's nothing. Just a little tired, you see? It's because we've been staying in this house all this time, isn't it? So you found food in a place as weird as this? I mean, yeah, not only does she have the cat, but she also has a candy. Yep, whereas he has a pretzel. Yep. And candy canes. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, but there seems to have been a ton of it, so you don't need to worry about that. Yeah, thanks. Please don't try doing more than what you can, okay? The gun, the gun burned always use, uses has been left here. Oh, I wonder if that key counts as a shiny. That's a good question. Okay, well, burn doesn't say anything new. Oops, shoot, I think actually, I have a bad tendency of clicking Pat a little too fast. Okay, there we go. Key. No. Nope. It is just something mysterious that has fallen here. I do, I do think I vaguely remember disliking that when I first played through, because I don't think there's, I don't think there's actually a good reason you can't pick up the key yet, like it's something that should have appeared later on or something. Uh, half a waffle. Sure. Just I, I guess go feed the breadcrumbs to the bird in the clock? Yeah. I think it, if I remember right, it kind of happens automatically, but... Oh, wait, no, no. Yeah, there's a good reason to go in here, then. So then, Ange, let's hand over some breadcrumbs to the little bird. The gray little bird looks this way with sad-looking eyes. Is there, okay. Gave the breadcrumbs the gray little bird. Huh. Well, bird looks this way with sad-looking eyes. Well, I guess four oh, is That's interesting. Each happy. time you give it, you gave it the breadcrumbs and some of the ground filled in. Yeah, yeah. So I think you can already tell this is kind of like a little puzzle thing. That Looks like it's what? got Cynthia in it. Yeah, I forget exactly what the finished picture is. Like, I that's not even spoilers. I just don't even remember. <laughs> well, time to sleep. Tick, 
Got talk. that creepy freaking thing in the back. That 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 cabinet of blackness that we have not yeah. been able to open yet. For some reason, and then I, I just worry. Can't I'm just sleep. sure there's something evil in there. Well, we still can't open it yet. Ah, it's nighttime. Well, let's go say hello to Burned. Do I have your gun? No. Burned is sleeping while holding on to a knife. Of course. Even though it'd be better to just sleep lying down. Yeah. And try. Because absolutely here. That's kind of a creepy smile. Yeah. Burr? Mm -hmm. Guess it's just my imagination. I should get sleep too. Can you go out the front door? Is it still boarded? I'm pretty sure no. It won't even let me check. Oh, the key! Door. Oh, the key's still there. Yeah. For a second. The key is is there forever, always. The clock is ticking very loudly. Is there something up with it? Uh, I don't think so. the The clock is the one with the bird in it, so I guess that's just it. Is it? It wants to remind you that the, the clock is ticking, and also gray bird. Four days left. When married on Wednesday. Ooh. I mean, married, that means it's time to get laid. <laughs> Morning. Uh, wah. Well, See all right ya. then. <laughs> See, I told you. Oh, man. Uh, Wednesday is the perfect day for lesbians. I think Ange is more after burned, but, uh, it seems, it seems, uh, Cynthia is interested in a whole other, whole other thing. Exactly. Oh, okay, then. Good morning, Ange. Good morning. No, wait. What is this? Why are you here? My Ange, why are you so angry like that? Because who else would get angry at this? Uh, anyone would get angry at this. Jeez, doing this without me knowing. Can't just say it's because you're a ghost or anything. <laughs> Angie, I'm in bliss. After all, I am now finally able to see you like this again. Now after having died, let's be together forever. Oh god. Okay, Ange? Hey, stop that! Angie, you're so violent! Can you stop this now? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Something happened oh to our bed there. I don't think it was lesbians. No, no. It's rotting even more. Huh? Cynthia, could you be feeling unwell? Somehow you don't look so well. Well, of course, I'm a ghost after all. I see. She does seem to look, be looking a bit more pale. Yeah. That's a. I mean, I don't know. Ghosts. I don't really have much to add about it. Huh? Feels the room has changed a little. Is it because of the fairies, I wonder? Yeah, it's rotted even more. Yeah, that's for sure. The colors dimming, and the ca cabinets are more broken up. And there's uh, static a lot more everywhere. Hey, Burned, what do you have to say about all this? Ah, Burr, good morning. Good, good morning. So you finally woken up. Uh, what? It's not like it's really late, right? Well, it's fine. I'll be, I'll be going to the other side. Okay. Sorry. I think my internet might have just hit a slow point. Oh, sorry. Need us to pause? 
No, I think we're good. Okay. Burr always looks cheerless. But what exactly is happening, I wonder? Doesn't seem like he's sleeping that much, and it'd be great if he isn't trying to do more than he can, but... I don't know. Uh, do you have anything to... No, you're just fooling me around right now. Well, you know what it's time for! Fuck no! the balloon police! <laughs> Fuck the balloons. All the huh, balloons. Huh, was that table there before? No, it wasn't. That must huh. be relevant to something. The castle? Want or whatever. How's the castle look? Uh... Castle actually still looks like it always did. It's funny, oh. this corner of the room specifically, I don't know if it'll always look better, but it's it looks better than the rest of the house does. Well, except for the torn up walls. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right, actually. There is a wall. There's a torn up. Never mind. There's a torn up wall right above the castle. I didn't see that. Hey, green guy. I don't really like gathering together. I feel more at ease alone, see. Fair enough, I suppose. I heard that Cynthia is becoming Angie's bride. Is that really true? Oh, God. <laughs> hey, who ever said that? Because of course that's untrue. Look at that blush. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I wanna... It's pretty, it's pretty intense. And you can see that, uh, Cynthia's gone a bit more vacant. You got the dark band yeah. starting across her eyes. <laughs> I'm sensing yonder! Oh no! Actually, it's good. It's good for me. <laughs> Eric, he was sort of a loud fella, but it feels a little lonely since he's been gone, doesn't it? Nah, I'm fine. He's dead. That's probably for the best. I don't like any of you fairy fucks. Uh... What is it, Anne? Uh, your highness Ange, I'd like for you to look for Darren. Darren? Uh, he's her friend. You haven't seen him recently. Does he look the same as you all? Yes, that's right. And please, for Darren. I guess these fairies don't consider that racist. Where should I have been searching, I wonder? Oh! Oh, this is the time limit here. What is this? I guess the cast. Oh, check the closet! Clothing perhaps. There's a picture can... of donuts. It's all... Okay, I don't have time to read all that. Uh, hmm, Darren is maybe in the other room? Oh no, we only have 11 seconds. God, I don't think I'm gonna get him in time. I didn't realize I'd be so limited on time here. God, how many holes are in the wall? Shit. We weren't able to find him in the end, were we? Uh, Your Highness Ange, what happened to Darren? I found this fallen down. It's Darren's clothing. There's a picture of some donuts beside, behind, beside it, but... Donuts. I see. It was because it was on Tuesday that we came here. Because it was already past Monday, right? That little one won't be found anymore, perhaps. Uh -huh. Your Highness Ange, thank you! Uh, here, as thanks. Oh, okay. So we still got our prize. Well, Quick I mean, we know thing. what happened to Eric, and that was Tuesday, so... If Darren was missing on Monday... Yeah, oh. I guess he Is died. that a gingerbread? Yeah. Can I just steal this? Ah, you are? Hello, Eng. I'm the Cookie Fairy! Hey, if you'd like, how about playing detective with me? Oh, well, I guess I should let you voice sure. him. Not only I is he a fairy, but, I mean, you're all- you're a detective, he's a detective, I bet you two get along great. You're probably even a cookie. I am not a cookie. <laughs> what proof do you have? I am not a cookie! <laughs> 
Ah, uh, whatever you say, Mr. Detective Cookie. Yeah. I shall have my vengeance. Ah, <laughs> uh, one would wonder how you will have your vengeance. You will see. Oh, sure. You will see. Ah, uh, whatever you say. Yeah, okay. Yay! Thanks very much! As for the topic, it'll be the size of everyone's home. If you get them all right, you'll get a gorgeous present as a reward. It's only for now! So, by the size of everyone's home, you mean to investigate those little well to- those well-to-do little ones, right? Guess that first would be to question them, right? Okay. Well, this sounds I'd imagine so. weird. There's lots of talking to the fairies in this. Well, that's exactly what you said before. Hey, Matthew, how big was your home? My home was not all that large. I was the second smallest after Anne's. This is a lot like last one's, but okay. So, his is the second smallest, and Anne's is the smallest? No, his was the, he didn't say hers is the smallest. It was the second he said smallest. Said second after smallest hers. after Anne, so he's two less than Anne. Yeah. Hey Anne, how big is your home? Smallest in the village. Wait, what? Oh. Second smallest. Okay, so his I get it now. So his, so it's Matthews is the is one bigger is a little bit bigger than Anne's. Yes. Hey Noah, how big is your home? It was bigger his home was than bigger than Anne's. We know it was bigger than Matthew. Olivia bigger than Noah. Okay, so it's, so so it's Olivia, biggest. Noah, and Matthew, Anne. Okay. I'll save just in case. Wasn't a particularly hard one. That one. No, this wasn't. Finished investigating. It was a cinch. Then for the question, answer in the order of smallest to largest house, okay? Oh, smallest to Anne? largest. Anne? Matthew? Noah? Olivia? Congratulations! Wait, I think you were reading him. Whatever. <laughs> Congratulations! You were correct! The order was from smallest house to largest, and Matthew, Noah, and Olivia, wasn't it? Okay, here, the gorgeous prize, a donut. This guy sure loves its donuts, doesn't it? Man, I want a donut. <laughs> I haven't had I one know of I want a donut. Uh, well, one day. And by that, I mean it probably isn't that hard Aww. to get a donut. And do you feel like you know the fairies a little more now? You'll need to know more about them. Anne and Matthew and Olivia and Noah, and in addition... Hey, that's enough already. Mr. Cookie, let's stop talking about this now. Yo, Cynthia. To you, the fairies are quite woeful beings, aren't they? You think they're pitiful, right? What do you mean, I wonder? Oh, you've forgotten already how they all thought of you. Hmm. How great, how great. How great, how great. Uh, this How cookie is deteriorating. Is you, How great it is that you're different from us. Cynthia is an obstacle in my way. I'm jealous. Let me take your place. Which is why I hate Cynthia. Ooh, that got disturbing. Yeah. Because you're in my way. That got creepy. <laughs> Cynthia is happy? That sure did get creepy. There's some, some Japanese words right there. Translation Don't notes. Not necessarily happiness. Stop that already! Eh? Stop, well, stop what? Oh, the poor cookie. 
It's all broken. Yeah, no, he was being eaten at. And why are you staring off into space like that? Has Blade Detective gotten boring or something? Uh huh. What just? You don't seem like you'll play for me any with me anymore for now, Ange. I'll ask later, so it's fine for now, though. Cleared happiness is. Oh, he got better fast. Apparently. All right. I don't think the fairies will say anything uh, too much oh. more relevant. Oh, let's go check on uh, Burned. Yeah. All right, I'll go check on him before exchanging for breadcrumbs, actually. Just in case he has any other sweets or something for me. Jeez, look at all those holes in the wall. Yeah, I know. Seriously. Let's... Actually... Oh, he's got books. Yeah. Most of these are just noticeable panels missing, but I actually find, uh, the- for whatever reason, this bottom one impresses me, because there's obvious some- there's, like, extra texturing for it, rather than just being a blank space. Yep. So, you know, I- I like that there was some extra work put on in, uh, on something obviously made an RPG maker. Also, huh. I don't know if you point out, but why does the couch have a happy face? It didn't before, it just now got one. Yeah, I guess Angie doesn't notice, but I sure do. It's because you notice everything. Obviously. Burr? Burr, you... what are those books for? Wah! Uh, Ange! What is it? What are you hiding them for? It's because, uh, it's a book that, uh, you're too- you're still too young for, see? <laughs> uh, he got burned in the middle of looking at his extensive porn collection, obviously. What are you reading? A not-so-good book or something? That's no good. You'd also be too young for it. Hand it over to me. Just a little, just for little. Studies and research on vampires. Ooh. Well, I can see why I'd hide that. There's some pretty shit vampire books out there. <laughs> not naming names, right? Ah, totally not. Yeah. Ah. Hey, more importantly, it's great weather today, isn't it? So, you know what the weather is, Burr, even though the winders have been boarded up? No, um, well, anyways, it's nothing. What now? Jeez. As I said, it's nothing. Nothing to do with you, Ange. Hmm. Ah, uh, does it feel like something's missing here? The ice cream on top isn't there anymore. Oh yeah, you're right. Well, I don't think there's anything else to do here. Yeah, yeah, a little... Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Sorry, everyone. As you may guess, an elder being has many, many things to be busy with. Yeah. <sighs> he was scheduling the latest season of, uh... Pain Darn it, that joke got despair. away from me. <laughs> well, I... I... Hmm? <laughs> I don't know, my brain just went blank. Never mind, just ignore me. I shall, Detective Jax. Don't I... worry. Your puny brain will come back to you soon enough. What okay. is it? Ah, it's nothing that... But... Just that... I hinted up hearing a bit of an unpleasant rumor, see? Just that maybe... In this house... Gah. Huh? What are you saying now? Vampires? There, there's no such. There's no way such things would be here. Well, I mean, both you and Burned have rather pronounced canines. I'm just saying. 
<laughs> you know, I've noticed that. They oh, do both have pointy teeth, don't they? Hmm? Oh, it seems that uh, I must take mortal nourishment. Give me just a moment to be back. Alright. Hmm. And we return once more. Yep, such interruptions in the world today. I blame God. you for all of them, Jax. Ah, that's right. I guess it really was really after all. You can forget about it. What was that about? Jeez. Well, in any case, let's go ahead and exchange our pudding and donut for breadcrumbs. Oh dear. Uh, if, I, if I lost you, huh? there you are. For a second, I lost you. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, what's this hey, in the ball. corner? Oh, it's Easter egg. Easter egg is put here for decoration. Cute, isn't it? Speaking of which, it's also an egg, right? Could this also perhaps be usable for making a waffle, I wonder? Try hmm. breaking it apart. Upon breaking it apart, there was a hair ornament found inside. Huh? This is... It is my hair ornament. Cynthia's? Ah, that's right. Angie, do you remember now? It feels so nostalgic. This is something you gave me back then. Angie. Angie. I've always remembered that time you saved me. I didn't do something all that great. No, I remember the words you told me that time, even now. It was because you were there for me, Angie, that my life was happy. Because you're a ghost, after all, right? How is every how great everything is for you, isn't it, Cynthia? With beauty, money, and a fiance, and great happiness, you're on a whole different level from me, aren't you? Well, what do you mean? Despite knowing nothing, how could you? Ah, I'm scared. If Miss Cynthia dislikes me now, I won't be able to live in this village anymore. Her family is the richest in this village, after all. Uh, uh, hey, what's with you all? You were... If you just listened to yourself, you'd find yours just saying stuff. Whether her life is envious or happy or whatever is not for you to decide. What happiness is, is something each person decides for themselves. Being rich doesn't mean being happy. Not even understanding that, you can't do anything but just feel jealous. Huh. It's getting quite deep, is this? Yes. I think you will find there's a reason that one such as me admires this game. Sure. What do you... what now? What do you mean? Feeling jealous or... Besides, is for you... what? Have something to say, then please, say it clearly. Enough already. Angie. Hey Angie, why do they use Easter eggs for decoration on Easter? That's because, you see, Cynthia, Easter eggs were a symbol of resurrection. They decorate them around to celebrate the resurrection of God on the third day. Just like as if being born from a chick's egg. You know, it's ah. the first time I've ever heard someone actually explain Easter eggs, and I still am not sure that's actually right. I don't know if that's actually right, but that's probably the best explanation I've ever gotten. Well, it's the first, well, it's the first explanation I've heard. 
Well, yeah, aside from the Easter Bunny, which, to be honest, is still a better explanation, because, I mean... Well, really... I, I more meant religious explanation, yes, for those who make I it a religious know. holiday. I know, I, I guess that's what I'm saying. I obviously don't make it a religious holiday, but I've never really understood why it is. Resurrection? Why was God resurrected? Is God a ghost? Yes. Cynthia, one of the few people, one of the few people in one of these games who doesn't know what Christianity is. Yeah, to be fair, this game, as I mentioned with the translation, was made in Japan. So... But I, I, I'm fairly certain that they've got some grasp of Christianity in Japan. Uh, they, ha they, have, they have a grasp of it, but it's not as strong as it is over here, I well, guess, yeah, is just what I'm saying. There's, like, Christianity is maybe a 1% of people there, uh, you know, yeah, yeah. actually believe in it All sort right. of thing. So, it, it, it's known, but it's more... Uh, it's almost more mythological, you know. Something we would use, like, Greek, Greek or whatever. Uh, right, I gods. Ah, I'm sorry, Angie. Was because the previous village I was in had no church. We were really poor, and there was no one to teach us. Oh, okay, that's the explanation. I guess what? that makes sense. To be fair, this game does seem like it's on, uh, probably not in Japan. It's probably yeah. in, like, England or some fantasy universe. Yeah, so, somewhere. In, it's in fantasy Europe. Yeah. As for me, you see. Ever since I've come here, I was suddenly dressed in pretty clothing, always being called cute, cute. I don't quite understand all of this. But you it, are cute. This is true. This is a green, green approved fact. It was because I was sold by my true father and mother and my current parents liked my appearance. Everyone says that I'm lucky and envious for becoming rich, but I'm not happy because it was due to my appearance that my mother and father sold me. See, it's nothing envious at all. That's interesting. Probably one of the first times I've heard something like that in a, uh, story. Yeah, I, I gotta admit, I haven't heard that one before. It's rare that I'm... I go, huh. It's, it's rare for me to have not heard one before, but I had not heard that one before. Mm. Thumbs up for me. <laughs> Cynthia. And so you see, Angie, I was really happy about what you said for me, because I've always wanted to say that back at them like that. Cynthia, here, you can have this! A cute hair ornament. <laughs> I made it a while ago. Hey, Cynthia, let's be friends. Yay, friendship. Huh? Friends? Why? After all, I... Cynthia, I'd like to know more about you. So, this is to show that we've become closer. Our friendship leveled up. <laughs> Angie. Da, 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 da. I was I can't remember the exact terms it uses, but I was I was trying to go like Persona 4 type. Oh. Thing. <laughs> oh, the Persona games are so good. They really are. I love Persona a ton. It's a shame that I'm probably not going to be trying 5 for a very long time, because I really want to. It's not- it's that hair ornament from that time. My precious hair ornament. God, from the egg. Likewise, my feelings, which were of sorrow that time, were reborn into something anew. Somehow, feeling is embarrassing, doesn't it? <laughs> Somehow, that's not very good English, and I'm sorry. But I have oh, to no. point it out. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, there's been a lot of those little 
Yeah. That's English. Yeah, I know. There's been lots of moments like that, but that one was, like, the most, uh, one of the more obvious ones. And that's why I really love you, my Angie. My Angie, soft and gentle like cheesecake. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh. Hey, stop that. Huh? A cutesy Miss Rabbit fell down, didn't it? This <laughs> is... The rabbit-shaped bread I used for decorations that time. Why would it be here? Tained rabbit bread. Clear we also obtained end of episode. Yes. <laughs> this has gone on longer than I had planned, but, well... Angie had some stuff to do, yo. I mean, well, not it. Uh, Cynthia had some to stuff to say. Hmm? Apparently, yeah. She had quite a lot to say. It's quite the backstory we got given there. Somehow feel so hungry. I'm starting to feel a little dizzy. Also thirsty, too. Where's Burr, I wonder? I don't know. I wonder if he is too hungry and thirsty, but regardless, thank you all for watching. And we will, we will see, see you, you next time. time.